Hello there, everybody. Um, so we've just had a delivery come from Amazon. Um, now this is the Alpha Camp uh, chair. Now it's for bigger people and my husband. We had it as a, a deal. It was marked up at was it fifty pound? Mm -hmm. I think it should be about seventy pound. And we had a deal for about twelve euros. Um, we could have it for fifty pounds, so we thought we'll get one just to try it out. I think the prices have gone back now, now so Andy's going to have a, a sit in this chair. I'm going to record it. Fold it up because without being horrible, if he falls, I shall uh, get it on camera. <laughs> so here's the chair. So folding it up. This is. It was all folded up when it came in a in a little so bag. To unfold it, you literally simple. Just do that. Now, we are buying things that will be handy if we, well, when we do get a out of harm, and this was being on the deal, we thought we'll just try one. Plus, there's always times where we go on holiday in a caravan, yeah. rent a caravan, and it's nice to sit out. Not that it's, it's winter now, and it's, the, uh, you know. Well, but, that's um, probably why these deals are on. Exactly. But, but it's something we can fold up and... But he's gonna go and he's gonna try it. it it's so bigger it. people, and so he's gonna try it, um, and test the chair. And if yes. if, the, if the chair if it doesn't hold big side people, we'll have a laugh. Yes, it is meant for the larger person, like fat lumps like me. Uh, so <laughs> no, that dog just the larger is size. Dicing there. with death, being under that chair. <laughs> Peanut. Yes. <laughs> come on I out. It's the worst place you can be. I didn't. Come on, little one. Right then, go on then, come get on in the chair. You best call him. That's it. He is. He's All right, ready? Go on. Two, three. Oh, okay. Right, what sure. do you think? Yeah. It's feel comfy. It's lovely. I mean, a little bit cut in here with the bar, but do you know what? This material is super strong. Lying me? Yeah. Not bad. Certainly, you certainly won't be needing them chairs when you've had your surgery. Well, even when I get a bit smaller. Touch wood, I hope I do. Still got to have it because it's going to be bad too. But, but look, yeah. Oh, that's it. We forgot to mention. So you've got no. a little thing here, which actually, hold on a sec. Let me try my flask. It is empty. I've drank my coffee, but yeah. I mean, I mean, it'll do. This is a is. flask. It's got a lid on, closed. So and you've got a zip here. Or, well, it's kind of silver lined, it's so I'm guessing then. it keeps things cold or keeps things hot. I suppose you could put a couple you of drinks. just put your gubbins in there, your phone and it, stuff. It's probably about eight, ten inches deep. It's a no nice size pocket. And if you look on the outside, you'll see how big yeah, it is. Yeah, it's quite a decent size. So. It's a nice handle. Yeah. And I've just looked and the deal's off, else we could have got another chair. But. Yes. Um, we'll just have to wait until they go down again. Yeah, so... We're in no rush. So, to... Now, let's see if I can get out of it. Okay, this is where... Yes. Wait there. <laughs> Ta da <laughs> And look, look. Ta da oh, I think that that's ain't a, bad, that ain't bad. Yeah, it Comes is. with a carrier bag as well. Oh, carry bags. So. Yes, so shame it's not on the deal. Still, I could have had another one. Oh well. Yes. Wait till after Christmas. So. Just a short video. It's uh, we paid for this. It's not you know sponsored or anything. See you in the next one. Keep safe. Now I love the doctor bits. I worship him. Right, he's our little. Uh, he's our world. But I have to shut the door when I do this prescription because this is what you've got. And you've got a few beds around the house and that's where he's done. Uh, it's just everywhere. So it's bye-bye Peanut and bye-bye Andy. 
because I'll be shutting the door. <laughs> Hi everyone. Uh, I just thought I'd uh, show you what the wife has to do every two weeks. Sorry about the lighting. Um, and uh, I'll let the wife kind of explain. Oh, it looks a bit dark. So this is our medication. Now, there's a tub here. Whoops, Daisy. It. it does look a lot. Um, we are on um, quite a bit of medication. Now, I do two weeks at a time. Um, but this stra sounds strange, but I do one week for me first, then I do another week and so on for Andy. It's just that my head, I can't kind of cope with doing it like all in one go. It sounds silly, but it's just the way I am. So it looks a lot of medication, but this is two weeks supply. So I'm going to start cracking on with this before I make mistakes. I mean, all this, we get our prescription every two months. So this is like two months. Well, this is less than <coughs> two months. Yeah, because we've already used a month's worth of it. Yeah. So it does get quite a lot. I can never do it. It's too complicated. It just, and I have to do it in a cup of coffee and in my own time because it's draining. <laughs> so. Anyway, I shall, might do a time lapse of her doing it or I might not. Uh, we'll see how things go. See ya. Keep safe. <laughs> Okay, that's took me ages. I am finished. Um, now there is some tablets I can't fit into these. It's our lighter pills, and we take them at night. But that's basically um, one week supply. But we have tablets upstairs that we take when we're in bed. It's just that these are the biggest contact, and um, you know, um, I don't know what you call them. Look, it's like a dossy box, really. Um, but this is the biggest we could find, so I'm very tired. It's took me ages, my fingers are all sore. Uh, one good thing about my so I'm on these are a nerve pain, a gabapentin. I'm on 10 of them a day, and usually I have to take 10 out of a strip. But thank god, they're just loose in a little tub. So that's Why, what you doing <laughs> that has saved me a long time but on cream crackers so that is some of the rubbish it's crammed in here i've still got more there's some in the bag over there some to throw just loads of packages and to be fair it 
uh, it does. It, I always say it takes the edge off the pain. Um, I'm really there's not really much else they can give me as in pain medication because I'm on quite a bit. So you know, God knows what'll happen. But anyway, I don't want to do pressure off. Um, that's enough from me. So we'll see you soon. Bye. Stay safe. Evening, everyone. We have just sat down. Uh, Lisa's had some jelly. And melon. And some melon. I've had some melon. And I've had a ham sandwich. And some crisps. They were fat free, no salt crisps. <laughs> and if you could believe that, then you believe anything. Well, YOLO, as they say. Uh, we're watching a film called Talk To Me. As usual with these uh, films, the wife pauses it because we have a debate about the actresses or actors in it and what other films they've been in. So, a film that would only take 120 minutes, hour and a half, it inevitably takes four hours for us to watch because every time we watch an actor, she says, I've seen her before. And yeah. you go, well, that's because she's an actor. Tris. No, it's actor now. Is it actor? Actor for man or woman. Okay. So it's actor. All right. So, uh, and then we have a big debate. Oh, what film she's on, what film this... And with Netflix, you don't get a legend. So you, you, it's not like a prime... And a I legend? Think, it's not called is it a legend? No. <laughs> yeah, it's called a legend. It's an in, uh, index or something, isn't it? It's not called an index. It's not called a legend. It's called a legend. It is not a legend. It's I'm telling extras you. extras or something like that. It's not extras. It's anyway, not legend. It's, it's a facility where you, the actors pop up and it tells you... Uh, of all the films I've been in which cuts the debate down by hours <coughs> but watching the Netflix it hasn't got a legend uh, so um, we're yeah. guessing there, and I was correct I'm, I'm pleased to say I am correct she's from War of the Worlds with Tom Cruise and the silencing which I'm correct about both. You said it wasn't, and I proved you wrong. So there you go. Uh, thought I'd better tell you this. Uh, we we'll stop bottling now. We're going to get back to the movie, and we'll see you in the next video. Stay safe. Stay safe. Just a quick video, it's quarter past eight in the morning. I'm an early riser, I usually wake up about 4 a.m. Uh, do bits around the house. Anyway, the dog usually comes down with me. Uh, he usually just falls asleep. But uh, I usually let him out in the garden. But around about eight o'clock, uh, if Lisa's had a, a good night, she'll wake up. And I don't know if it's some sort of internal clock or the light or something, but the dog around eight o'clock always goes. I don't know if you can see this. Let me see if I can turn this around. Around. I don't know if you saw that, but the dog waits at the bottom of the stairs for his mummy, uh, Lisa. Weird. It's like he knows she's going to wake up around this time. Just thought I'd share that with you. It's weird how dogs know. Anyway, I'll see you in the next bit.